Well, people in North and South Carolina are struggling to get online. Recent data from the FCC shows more than 8 million homes and businesses can't access reliable high-speed internet. Right now, the Biden administration is seeking solutions to bridge that digital divide by giving more than $40 billion in funding to all 50 states. So where's the money going? WCNC Charlotte's Lexi Wilson is joining us now from Freedom Park in Charlotte with that breakdown. Lexi. Well, we use the internet just for everything these days, and for those of us who have it, we may take it for granted, but for those who do not, this money could be life-changing. The Carolinas will get about $2 billion. In 2023, high-speed internet is nearly a necessity, but many people are still disconnected. About 7% of the country's population still doesn't have broadband access that meets minimum standards. Funding is always a challenge to address this issue, although most recently, in, in part driven by COVID, there's an increase in federal, state, and local spending. Now, the Biden administration is looking to close the gap through the Broadband Equity Access and Deployment Program called BEAD. It will help implement the infrastructure to improve internet access to areas that need it. South Carolina will get over $500 million. North Carolina will get $1.5 billion. For some folks in North Carolina, the ability to actually have the wires in the ground that come to your house don't exist. Bruce Clark is the executive director for the Center of Digital Equity in Charlotte. He says the timeline for the project notes that the state and local planning process will happen in the next coming months. The goal is to get reliable internet access to every person in America by 2030. Digital equity is so important because it's foundational to our ability as a society to solve and address basically any other opportunity we have.